so to fix this error you have to uninstall this interception file so maybe in past while installing any drivers you might have installed this interception file on your computer and you have to uninstall this now if you don't find this interception file and if you don't know how to uninstall it in that case if you don't find this interception in that case you have to install it then you have to uninstall it so in google search in search in google search just type in how to install interception file now you will see all the instruction in google and then you can install this interception file now once you install it then you have to install it using this command so if this interception file is in c drive so for example i'll show you if if i open c drive if you have this install interception file in c drive in that case type in cmd in windows search box make a right click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator make sure that you open this as an administrator and then click on yes to allow and then you have to paste the command on command prompt window so copy this yeah and then paste it over here and then hit the enter key here you can see it's installed now you have to uninstall this so copy this and then paste it over here hit the enter key and here you can see uninstall now you have to restart it can be restart the master for this and after the system restart you can check you should not receive there now if you have this interception file in downloads folder in that case you have to again install it at the end you have to type in install install it then you have to run this command to uninstall it follow the same process but instead of your username just type in your username so whenever you download any file if it goes to uh, download folder so this may be the location over here so you can just write down your username over here and then you can you, you have to inst install it first and then you have to uninstall it and then restart your computer and then check now still you are receiving the error message then if you have these application or tools running you have to close these application or tools so you can just make a right click on the start menu and then go to task manager for example i don't have all the application but i'll give you some example so if you have this daemon tools make a right click then click on end task if you have this make a right click click on end task to launch the game now if you have this r e w a s d running so if you have it running make a right click and then click on end task if you have this dear astro burn ds4 windows so find this so i have ds4 windows running make a right click end task if you have face it anti cheat running make a right click click on end task if you have this riot vanguard logitech also if you have this auto hot key running on your computer you can close this make sure it is not running over here also and you can also end it from the task manager if you find it in the task manager so i don't have it running if you find it close it and if that does not work you can even uninstall auto hotkey and then restart your computer and then check now also you have to disable these from the device manager so if you have these services or uh, device running in device manager uh, make a right click on the start menu go to device manager and for daemon tools this is just an example so open device manager and then exp expand uh, storage controller and you might see daemon tools over here i have only one uh, over here if you see two daemon tools make a right click then click on disable device click on yes later on whenever you need this application you can enable it expand this universal bus controller make a right click then click on disable device later on when you want it you can enable it also if you have any other um, tools running in device manager you have to disable it from the device manager so if you find one of these in device manager also uh, if you have this xvdd scsi mini port or daemon or corsair in device manager running you can make a right click disable it 
So if you have this XVDD SC SI mini port, you can make a right click, you can disable it, then relaunch the game and then check. You can always enable this afterwards and then check. If that does not work, you can even uninstall these application from your computer, restart your computer and then launch the game. Also make sure this is not running over here. So any other third party application, Logitech, Quitek. So close everything. So also close third party application, which you're not using. Also end services process, pro services or process from the task manager. If you have VLC codec or wallpaper engine, MSI apps, Intel driver update, unplug all the external devices, which you're not using. So try this and then you can launch the game and then check. You should not receive this error anymore. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time. And please like this video and subscribe to my channel.